Hello, my friends, and welcome to 1996's Critical Mass, a game you can actually still buy today. Um, the author, uh, hang on. this guy, Sean O'Connor, uh, as you can see in 1996, was um, nice enough to send me a registered version of the game, uh, and I was supposed to record Fargate this week, but it would not capture. I know I said I'd record Fargate, but... Um, couldn't get it with OBS. It was flickery as hell. Couldn't run it in a window, which is usually the solution. And I even lowered myself to NVIDIA Shadow Play, and it wouldn't capture it at all. So I had to come up with a plan B, and this is going to be the week after. So I figured I'd do this. Uh, Critical Mass is a game of squadron-based starship combat uh, with fighters and such. And uh, you create a squadron, you create a commander, and you create a squadron... And there are a couple interesting things. One, you don't have full control over your squadron. Like, you give them orders on a squadron level, and then they do their thing. Uh, and the game comes with lots and lots of missions. So we're going to create a new commander. Ruben, uh, so that's me. Squadron, yeah, sure, and race. I don't know what the differences between these guys are. Stralian, Rickium, Merrick, hang on. Uh, let's, let's see. Uh, yeah, there isn't a lot of um, help info here. So, yeah, I, I guess, okay, so let's pick one at random. I'm closing my eyes, I'm closing my eyes, I'm closing my eyes, boom. No, it doesn't matter. Uh, yeah. Okay. Maricon. So, we're going to be a Maricon squadron. Maricon! <laughs> Proud to be an American. Or <laughs> at least I know I'm... Okay. Um, so, let's, let's do it. And then we get to choose our ships. So... These are the ships with their lasers and their armor and their missiles. Ultra drone, and you only have 350 to start with. So I am not sure. Like, do we want to start with just scouts? Do we want to... And here's the thing. When you put a ship here, it's your ship. Hornet. Like, the temptation is to really give yourself a nice ship and then spend just a little money on the rest. But do I want to do that? Or do I want to spend a little less... And these are different things. These are like their missiles and their engines. So more engines means more maneuverability. Uh, all the, this is how many like command they have scanners. Um, you know, I can show you. Oh god damn it! Just go away. Just just go. No. Um, does get explained here, I believe. Yeah. So super shield missile launcher. Missile launcher, radar, engine, repair bot, stealth, cargo. So all those things mean something. So, yeah, we're going to keep that. Oh, boy. Ooh, I like that one. Doesn't have many, much in the way of engines, though. Ooh, the Cobra. We can probably afford several of those. Or we can afford several of those. Oh, this is tough. Because I really like, um, what was one? I really liked, um, I really like this one too. Let's see, Mega Drone, Mega Drone, Observer, Scout, Scout, Viper, Drone, Drone. Okay, so, hmm. Let's try this. Let's try... Yeah, we can do that. And then... Oh, we only have one Viper? 
All right, well then. So I used every credit. That's pretty neat. So we have a decent mix here of some more maneuverable ships and and mine because I'm kind of a dick. Uh, let's hit OK. So if you've ever played a game like Over the Reich or Octung Spitfire or the more recent Starhammer, uh, the Vanguard Prophecy or Battlestar Galactica Deadlock, you'll recognize this kind of movement system where you pick where you're going to move uh, for one turn. And uh, as you can see up here, you have uh, you can view your objective. Defend a freighter. What freighter? Wait, where's the freighter? Oh, that's the freighter. So we have to defend that freighter. Okay. And you can give your squadron orders. And you could also give them you know, spacing. Uh, so, yeah, right now we're going to leave this at attack at will. So, yeah, you only have I only have control over my ship. So we are going to, I don't know where our enemy is right now. I feel like we should spread out because they could be hiding in a lot of different places. But right now, we're just going to move forward. Oh, that's neat. That's good. I didn't know you could do that. Oh, there we go. All right, so it's in the... Oh. Yeah, this runs only in a window, so to get the full effect of everything, I'm, uh, I am uh, maximized it, and then I'm running display capture. So I had to hide my taskbar there. Um, so that might pop up every now and again. I apologize. Select missiles to launch from here. All right. That was dumb. Game told me to do that. You saw it. We haven't found any enemies yet. Yeah, but once we do, this is going to start lighting up. Um, your controls are a bit funky because you, you don't have, like, countermeasures or anything. It's just move and shoot, basically. Image your ship is shown here. Apparently I can eventually have two more ships. Let's go back to the middle. I haven't found anybody yet. The freighter is really trailing behind. What was that? I don't know what that was either, Harry. I don't know what that was either. Is the ship damaged? Doesn't look like it. So what was that? Probably, oh. Now you get to see the AI fly around asteroids, which is really neat. Cat wants attention. Buddy, I'm recording right now. Oh, no, don't show me your tummy. Oh, he is such a beta cat, you guys. He's showing me his tum tum. Gosh. But don't ever rub his tum tum. That's a Venus flytrap. Okay, Harry, I gotta do this. Okay. <laughs> Haven't found anybody yet. That's really weird. Oh, come on. Hey, yeah, see where the ship is. Uh, Where are the bad guys? We are leaving the freighter behind. I don't like this. Should maybe slow it down a bit. Yeah, they're not slowing down at all.
All right, time to change formation. Shit. Did I just hit another ship? Oh my god, I just hit another ship. I did. Yep, I did. I forgot, there's collision in this game. Oh, mother shitting fucking fuck. Did we just lose? I think we lost. I think we lost you guys. Yeah, I think the freighter's done. I think we I think we lost it. We got too far ahead of it. Uh, there we go. Yeah, we lost the freighter. The AI is going at it. Oh! Good job, AI. What is that? Escape pod. Interesting. Oh, there's another guy. Where am I? I'm heading toward him. God, I feel stupid. Yeah, this game does not mess around. Oh, there, and there's another one. All right, I'm going to go for that one. Whoops. Is it going to hit the asteroid again? Yes, it's exactly what it's going to do. Yeah, I didn't say I was good at this. I've never played this before. Did I just hit somebody else? Oh my god, I did. Okay. Whoops. God damn it. Gonna try and get a better lock on one of these guys. God, stupid. Damn, I'm terrible. I'm trying to make a tight turn around his backside. Oh, let's let's try and make. Oh yeah, he's right there, isn't he? Dang. Crap. I am hit. And yeah, I am damaged. One of my engines is out. One of my pieces of pizza is out. Um. Don't these missiles have any kind of tracking whatsoever? That's a cool looking ship, actually. Oh, maybe it does have some basic tracking. Oh, good. Good. Wait, what? Oh, are those escape pods? Oh, crap. No, they aren't. It's not getting his way. Crap, no. We're going to try and... I know, I know, I know. Oh, man, there's more. Whew! Okay, that was lucky. Yeah, 
Dang it. Ah! Oh, yeah, okay. And, yeah, oof, wow, okay. Mission over. Oh! It survived. Oh. Freighter was destroyed. We failed. Well, I'm probably going to stop there because that was embarrassing. And I have no idea how the next, how long the next mission will take. And I'm trying to keep these under half an hour. So, uh, yeah, that's this game so far. And I'm terrible at it, but I hope to get better. Uh, the lack of a tutorial is not helping me. It's my, that's, I'm, I, I wish there was more, like, way to train but i guess you just train by doing so thanks for watching guys and we'll see you for whatever's next bye